We talk politics now and activities ahead of the forthcoming general election in Zamfara State. The All Progressives Congress Campaign Council says it is sure of a landslide victory for the All Progressives Congress in the state. Former Governor Abdulaziz Yari stated this at the inauguration of the campaign councils in Goso. Former Governor Yari, who is the chairman of the APC's campaign council, also frowns at the recent clash between supporters of the two leading political parties in the state and warns against the use of weapons during election campaigns. Chivis News, the Ophelos Starify reports. The Independent National Electoral Commission has repeatedly promised that the 2023 general election would be free and fair due to the introduction of technology. But the major threat to this being fulfilled is the tendency by some politicians to resort to violence to have their way. Hired talks may be deployed to disrupt elections in some areas and scare people from coming out to vote on election day. This is what many Nigerians want INEC and security agencies to address before election day. In Zamfara, supporters of the People's Democratic Party and the APC have already clashed twice in three months, and this has led to the loss of lives with many injured and campaign properties destroyed. The former Zamfara state governor, who doubles as the chairman of the APC campaign council, Abdulaziz Siari, condemns the use of political thugs carrying dangerous weapons during election campaigns. He says his committee will not condone any act of thuggery and has designed strategies to tackle the problem. The former governor calls on political parties to embrace peace before, during and after elections. We are in power. Therefore, we have to tolerate more than enough, or more than what we can think of as a leaders. And at the same time, I call on other parties to embrace peace. Is there, is there in the INEC guidelines? Is there in the Electoral Act? So therefore, we don't expect any party to come with the form of violence Coming with talks of thuggery and violence is not part of what democracy is all about. The two-time former governor who is seeking election as a senator noted that landslide victory for the APC presidential candidate and other candidates in Zamfara is sure. From 2003 is ANPP, 2011 is ANPP, 2015 is APC, 2019 is APC. So I, I know God that did it to us in the past, that God is still there, so it's good for us. Earlier, the director general of the campaign council, a former minister and senator Tijani Hayakaura, charged members of the council to be vigilant and committed to the discharge of their responsibilities as they were chosen based on their track records. The Zamfara State APC campaign council has as members two former governors, two former deputy governors, former and seven senators, former and seven ministers, as well as former and seven members of the Zamfara State House of Assembly, including Speaker Nasir Moazu Magaria. Safe, Lesdarufai. TVC News, Gusau.